All right, Shalom, call Halal, Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rachahakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone. Peace and salutation to the elect, the house of David. So I just uh, did a quick uh, impromptu uh, rolling in the spirit, uh, dealing with how our people, you know, are fervent and have all of the opinions in the world and, you know, stand on morality and have standards when it comes to another person that is of their 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 race, you know. But that same boldness and that same morality is never there when it comes to the heathen nations, mainly Esau, Edom, you know, mainly Esau, Edom. OK, the so-called white man, the man who is responsible. All right. For their downfall. All right. And we through the Holy Spirit understand why that happened. And you Jake's don't y'all don't want answers, man. You know, Jake would much rather, you know, have, you know, have a social media platform. All right, get likes, views, and, you know, donations, and pretty much that'll be the kingdom of heaven for him, man. But the Lord has uh, way more than that promise for us. But in that video, one thing that I forgot to point out, and one group of people, one group of special uh, people who have their lot within this story, uh, in that whole, uh, in the whole grand scheme of things, is the scoffers and scorners, man. And my thing is, where y'all at, man? The only time the scoffers and scorners have something to tell Israel is when it's basically about another Israelite, man, or something that they don't they don't agree with with another Israelite. Outside of that, they're not breaking down no prophecies for you. OK, and ultimately, they're cowards. They're not breaking down. All right. Putting you in a right mind frame They're They're basically put their emotion. All right. Out to you as a doctrine, man. And that's all you get from these guys. All right. And a bunch of other worldly bullshit, man. Here it is. We 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 are at the at the time where we're about to get the kingdom. And we're we're behind enemy's lines. So that means that we're we're in the threat of intimate, in, intimate, imminent death. If you are a believer in this truth, man, you're about to catch serious hell, man. And that's the mind our people need to be put in the right mind frame because our people are full of folly. All right, and if you've been blessed and you have a platform to 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 uh, push that word, if you've been comforted in these latter days, then ultimately you should be comforting the nation of Israel outside of your damn emotion or what you disagree with. All right. One thing that we all know is sure that the so-called white man is the devil. OK. And you people who watch these videos and and, and, and laugh along with these people and, and think it's all good. You're going to be judged for that, man. OK, because where are the scoffers and scorners at, man? OK, now all of these different videos and i'm not gonna even harp on it but all these different videos about brothers and us being pedophiles and all of this well right now we have proof of the true pedophile it's the proof is in the pudding like like the the worldly saying it's it's out there man okay this man is being exposed on all levels man the the and the scripture said that the man of sin would have to be revealed before the end came so why aren't these dudes helping to expose the man of sin? If that's a prophecy that must come to pass, that's showing you that these guys ain't the prophets, man. Where are the scoffers and scorners at, man? Where's all of that big, bad uh, 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 testicular fortitude and willingness to expose and do a video when it comes to the, to the devil, man? To the man who raped, robbed, and murdered your forefathers, man. To the man who, who constantly blasphemes the name of the Lord, man. And blasphemes who you are. He's over in, 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 in Israel saying he's the Jew. And you ain't got nothing to say about them? Well, everybody know that. Oh, really? You people, you niggas are a bunch of cowards, man. A bunch of goddamn cowards, man. This is uh, Sirach 37. Uh, and 10, it says, Consult not with one that suspected thee. All right? You don't tell just anybody your damn business, man. Okay? Somebody you know got an evil eye towards you. You don't open up. All right? Uh, uh, and, and tell him what you really got going on in, in, your, in your dark secrets. He'll, he'll go and tell every goddamn body, man. And hide thy counsel from such as envy thee. Okay? Neither consult with a woman touching whom she is jealous. You don't talk to your woman about your other woman. If, if you know she got a problem with that, that ain't going to work. All right. 
neither with a coward in matters of war. So don't consult with a coward in a matter of war. We're at the time of war, man. We're in a spiritual war, man. Our lives are on the line and you got niggas sitting back playing games, or arguing about shaving. But, but when it comes to doing the grit work, what it's going to take to get the kingdom of heaven, these guys are nowhere to be found, man. Nowhere to be found, man. Well, what's up with that? So, so, so great millstone is worse than a so-called white man. Great millstone is worse than, than the so-called Jew. Great millstone is worse than Babylon the Great. You that okay? You you disagree with us? Okay, cool. We get it. But 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 you're not gonna disagree with with the system that you're in that's trying to put your children full of vaccines and turn them into homosexuals, man. You just had an issue where Jake walked up to a Edomite my teacher like, you you, why did you make my uh, grandson wear a fucking dress, man? And they're doing this stuff right before your face, man. And you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans ain't saying a goddamn thing, man. But then to the ones who are standing up and saying something, that's that's when you all of a sudden got 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 everything to say, man. That's when you grow a pair of balls. That's when you have an opinion. You see, you got an opinion about us going out there. Oh, they, they too rough. But the so-called white man ain't too rough. You do an exposed video on the Israelite and bring out everything, man. Look what he did. Go to his Instagram. Go here. Go there. Put his address up. All of these different things. But when it comes to the so-called white man, you're a goddamn coward, man. When it comes to standing up and, and, and putting your neck out there for your how about shimmy out shot, you know where to be found. But when it comes to what you disagree with or what we going off on, you, 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 you're right there. Faithful. You goddamn niggas. Hey, and the Heavenly Father's gonna kill all, every, each and every last one of you guys, man. Cause you ain't right. And it's time out for the, for the games, man. Hey, I'm trying to get the hell up out of here, man. But well, we trying to. Nigga, shut your ass up. Hey, and the, man, hey, hey, I throw up curses on you niggas every day, man. That's what I'm finna start doing, man. Cause the vibration of you niggas going away is, 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 is gotta be pushed more, man. Because at the time that Moses, okay, was, was on the scene, there was a whole generation that had to die out amongst the unfaithful of our people. And that same narrative is here today, man. The same rebellious, all right, Israelites are back here today, man. They're back here today doing exactly what they did in, in the wilderness, man. Okay, and they're fearful at the time. And they're coming back with a bad report. Like those, like the, uh, the, because at the time of Joshua and Caleb, there was a, uh, 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 there was one man sent out of each tribe. So 12 in total men, all right, set up to go scope out the land, right? I'm going to get that story. I'm going to go into that, man. Because you guys are cowards, man. And out of the 12, only two had a good report. Okay. And that two was, uh, uh Joshua and Caleb, Joshua, Ephraim. All right, Caleb was Judah, so what is that? That's basically the, the, the elect, okay? That's symbolic of the elect, okay, who have that good report, who are of another spirit, man, okay? Now, um, what was I going to say? And, and out of those 12, okay, only two had a good report. The other 10 came back with a cowardly report, man, meaning they came back with news that really... That the, the, wouldn't go lead to us getting that land. Well, we can't. It's 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 impossible. And that's what you. A lot of you, Jakes, man. You you don't believe in the power that we have, man. You don't believe that the Lord is gonna take this man down. You 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 in your mind, you like this is crazy. I got my family. They they cursing. You know they make us look bad. So we're gonna help the world tear them down. All right. Meanwhile, the so-called white man goes free. Nigga, do you you scoffers help the help the so-called white man? You scoffers are pro Edomite, man. Cain is a Cain gang, man, all day. You niggas are of the Cain gang, man. That red gang. You repping that red Cain gang, man. You see, that's what you're all about. You of your father the devil, man. Okay, you're of your father the devil. And the world, hey, we don't need you niggas, man. You you're not gonna we there's a 
particular line of you niggas who, who, who have to go in order for us to get the kingdom of heaven, man. Hey, you can do the videos on us, man. Hey, we're, we're out there on the internet any damn way, man. We, we're the ones putting our neck on. We're out on the front line uh, risking our lives even even much more nowadays because the, the devil has basically told us, nigga, I, I, I see you. And what has the so-called white man did to any, all right, so-called Negro, Latino, and Native American organization that tried to get themselves together? He went and infiltrated and tried to destroy it, man. And he's already trying to do it. But thank God. Thank you, how about Shimiao Shai for the elect because they're not going to be infiltrated. They're not going to be sold out, man. And that's what, what Esau is ultimately up against and you niggas, what's written, man. Okay? So don't consult with a coward, okay, as, as concerning matters of war, man. And you guys are cowards, man. You're not willing to take the true stand. You only stand when it comes to one amongst your own nation because that's the easy and comfortable way out. You see, but taking a true stance against wickedness, that, 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 that's play. That's everybody doing that. Y'all do enough of that. Whoa, whoa, what, nigga? Hey, man, the Heavenly Father is about to get rid of a lot of niggas, man. Okay? And, and we gonna keep exposing this devil because he ain't right. You Edomites, man, you ain't right. You Edomites are the worst thing going, man. But what's even worse than the Edomites sometimes is two-thirds of our people, man. The ones who know that the Israelites are the worst. They don't apply any of the scriptures, man. When they fit, it's, it's their emotions, and, and, and that's it. They don't, they, they don't uh, turn, hey, hey, what does the scripture say? If we're so wrong, then ain't you supposed to turn the other cheek? And, and, and instead of avenging yourself? Hey, didn't the scripture say don't take matters of vengeance into, into your own hands? Right? But these guys don't apply anything that's Messiah-like, man. And you niggas follow after it and love it, man. That's why, man, the Heavenly Father is getting ready to do a whole bunch of destruction amongst our people, man. And rightfully so. Because when I first came into Israel, man, I was that, you know, we got to love Israel, man. I love my people and all of these different things. But, man, now I get it. I totally get the whole thing, man. I get it. I mean, and I'm at peace with two thirds of you niggas gonna have to just be destroyed, including your children, your your grandparents, your mothers, your fathers, you. All there's a, there's a particular seed line amongst our people that ain't gonna inherit the promised land, man. You got the 144,000, all right, under the Messiah with King David being the head of that church. He's the head disciple, and then. You have the large multitude, the rest of the men, women, and children whom the Lord is going to have mercy on. Everybody else got to go. Okay, and we're going to help in that process, man. The scriptures say we're going to purge out the rebels, man. Okay, once we get those new bodies, okay, there's a there, they, we're going to have a part, all right, because we'll, who was the keys given to? All right, hey, he said, I will give you the keys, man. Okay, and it, and it starts with David, but under him, that's that house, man. And that house is going to be given the judgment under the Messiah. So you niggas, man, hey, keep going in your wickedness, man, because you know where to be found. And in, in we're in a spiritual war. You know where to be found. You ain't doing nothing. You ain't saying nothing. OK, you you all you're doing is putting your big ass head in the screen. OK, and complaining and talking shit about nothing that nobody that's really not going to help anybody to get to the kingdom of heaven, man. You goddamn faggots, man. You dudes are some spirit spiritually you 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 neutered, man. You ain't if you how, how you how you not gonna stand up, all right, to the so-called white man in boldness right now, man. Right now is the time, man. To this day, baby. <laughs> to this day, man. To this day, you should be standing up. Hey, fuck it, man. If you die, you die, man. Hey, this man is the devil, man. Hey, when King David got his rulership, his throne, he boasted. And, and, and having his his foot over Edom's neck, man. He said that. He was like, Moab is my wash pot, meaning they're, they're, they're in servitude. All right, over Edom will I cast my shoe. Okay, meaning your enemies are going to be your footstool, man. You see that? You see that? Then he rejoiced the Philistines too. So th those main three, okay, were, 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 were in his mind, very, very important 
and very, very, it was very, it was a, it was an accomplishment in his mind to have them in subjection, man. Okay. He loved it. But, but how right now, before these devils are going to fall, you're not going to be on fire to get on his ass. But then when it comes to your own people, when it comes to anybody who looks like you, who's of the same nation as you, you going hard, man, on the boulevard. That don't make no damn sense, man. You niggas are a bunch of damn cowards, man. Okay. <laughs> Let me uh get get a few more. Get a few more. One one or two more, man. You guys are something else, man. Yeah, so you guys ain't ain't you nobody need to be listening to you niggas except the two thirds, man. Revelation twenty one and seven. He that overcometh shall inherit all things, and I will be his God, and he shall be my son. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and the murderers and the whoremongers and the fearful and unbelieving. You guys are fearful and unbelieving. You got a horrible report. You coming back with a horrible report. But the elect have the right report, man. And we go into all things. Yeah, we get on two-thirds of our people. Yeah, we get on you guys sometimes. Which now we're at the point of ignoring you. But I just had to put this out there, man. You know? And pretty much the scoffers and scorners are a thing of the past, man. But I just had to put this out. That's some real whole ass shit. To 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 see how some of you guys are moving uh right now, man. You know? God damn, man. This is this is this is horrible, man. You ought to be ashamed of yourselves, man. But at the end of the day, the Lord chose you to be in that spirit. Hey, and the Lord chose us to be in this spirit. Alright? As the Lord said about Joshua, he was of another spirit, man. Okay, but the but the fearful and unbelieving and abominable, the murderers and the whoremongers and sorcerers and idolaters and all liars shall have their part in a lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. And see, this is what's coming to uh, our people, man. They don't understand the, the magnitude of what's about to happen on the planet Earth, man. Okay, when we warn about Esau, Edom, and we talk about these things, people are just taking it with a grain of salt. They're not really ex uh, expecting it to actually hit. But when it does, oh boy, oh boy, man. Hey, and I'm going to finish off in Isaiah, man. The perfect book to finish off in, man. Hey, if you're an Israelite, you're supposed to be in the spirit, man. You're supposed to be turned up in the spirit, man. Like the elder you call said, man. If you're an Israelite, man. Right now, okay, yeah, we go through our little bouts and things in the flesh. But man, that should be overcome by the joy of the kingdom of heaven being right there in your face. And your enemy getting get, he, body blows. It's all spiritual, man. Body blows. Knock his ass out the ring, man. In the Holy Spirit, man. He's finished. He's ready for the taking, man. He's going to come see. You niggas fear. You you only fear what you see. You don't fear your how about Shemiah was shy, man. You look at this man's army and his police and what he can do. He can kick your door in. But you don't understand who controls his ass. You don't understand that the word was already written that the elect are going to overcome. So if you if you if you believe that and believe that he is... None of those things would matter to you. You wouldn't even fear it. You, would, you, you wouldn't fear losing your job. Because it's already written that the servants are going to eat. All you can do is what's right according to the Holy Spirit and what you were commanded to do, man. And if the Lord don't have mercy on you, at least you could say you did hey, well, everything that you could do to the best of your ability. Isaiah 66 and 1. Hear the word of the Lord, ye that tremble at his word. And we're the ones that fear the Lord and tremble at his word. You guys get the word and just play games and dry out and fizzle out and get weak and then start trying to blame everybody else. And then it's funny, you niggas, you guys, you guys only, you guys hate us and we're the worst thing going. Then you leave and all you talk about is us. Well, nigga, you free. Ain't you supposed to be free from the, uh, from, from the, uh, the, the, the oppression of Great Millstone, <laughs> of the lies of the of the man worshiping man pleasing great millstone members you're supposed to be you're supposed to be free nigga run nigga get free and he, he every time you look up this nigga looking in the in the, in, in the uh, hole in the gate man okay <laughs> with a butt ice all right your brethren that hated you that cast you out for my namesake said let the lord be glorified but he shall appear to your joy and and they shall be ashamed, man. 
So he's going to appear to our joy and you guys are going to be ashamed, man. I just wanted to put that out there, man, because, yeah, you got the two. You got our people who don't know that they're Israelites that have that spirit of when it comes to their own people, they, they, they're the first to speak at the forefront, have morality, have standards. But when it comes to the devil, they have nothing to say. But that's the same thing with you niggas who know that you're Israelites, man. All right. You all you all in the same gang. And that's the that's the Cain gang, man. OK, you you go on in the way of Cain and Cain is played out, man. Cain's a sucker. Cain ruined every goddamn thing, man. Try, he tried to cut off the righteous. That's what you, you're here to do the same thing as him. Okay, if you can get rid of Great Millstone and then still live amongst America with chemtrails and your children getting vaccines and all that, you'd be okay with that because we gone. <laughs> you niggas ain't shit, man.